Hi there guys, Bren here from FireRecruitmentAustralia.com and today I just want to answer a question actually. There's been a lot of conversation going around about the group assessment for the Victoria Fire Service as in CFA, MFB or FIV for the upcoming recruitment. So basically to answer the question and to give you some context, the idea is to have a think about why, why do they have a group exercise? So what it is they're trying to assess in you throughout the group exercise. So from my viewpoint, it's how you interact with people, how you present yourself, and have you got the ability to work effectively within a team. So if I was going to the group assessment myself currently, I would make sure I had a really good introduction based on my previous life and work experience, and I'd make sure I worked on that so that it was a really good intro. If you get asked for an introduction, make sure it's relevant to the environment and position, otherwise you'll be doing yourself a disservice. Bear in mind, if you've got a task that you have to complete as a group, it doesn't really matter what the task is. So many people get caught up on what the activity is specifically. You're not going to have a real advantage by knowing what the specific task is. It's actually about knowing how to interact within a team. All right, they want to see what attributes and skills you bring to the team. So don't be overbearing or underbearing and not contribute. You've got to think about if you find yourself in a leadership position that you facilitate other people's participation and that you get ideas from the group so that you can contribute to a positive learning outcome. So the big ones are make sure that you're presented well, that you can interact well, and that you're prepared for the day. So that's just a bit of context on the group exercise of group assessment that Victoria is currently running. And the same applies for most group assessments you will come across. Look, hopefully you found some of that helpful. If you have, please give us a thumbs up below. Don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss any updates. And if you have any questions, as always, you can contact me on the link below or visit firerecruitmentaustralia.com. And that's where you'll see the latest in firefighter recruitment across the country as well. My name is Brent. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next video.